Okay, it's gonna gonna create a basic login program where the user must enter his username and the password. If both is correct, we'll just show a message that says something like correct. If it's not the same, uh, we'll show a message or display something that tells us it's not correct. Gonna use two edit boxes, two labels. Okay, this will be for the username. So it's gonna enter information, click on the button, then we're gonna let's display it in a label. Then we can display it in a label at the bottom, correct or wrong, something like that. So the event on click. So we're gonna use if statement if edit one dot text is equals to let's say the username is John and the edit two dot text is equals to let's make the password Apple. Okay, so if the username is John and the password is Apple, then I want to display then I want to display something in label three. Label three dot caption. Let's display something like correct. Okay, we have an and over here. So both conditions need to be true. So we're going to put this in round brackets. Okay, so Delphi is going to check whether this side is true and this side should be true if both is true i'm going to display correct in label three okay now else okay else that means that one of these two will be false so if it's, if it's not correct i'm going to display the message wrong. Okay, it's John and the password is Apple. Correct. If I change it to Apple one gonna say wrong okay another thing that you can maybe check here is that the text is actually case sensitive so the lowercase j and the upper uppercase j will not be seen as the same thing because the ASCII value of uppercase and a lowercase character is not the same so remember this is sensitive so you will have to 
into it as uppercase J. John and Apple for you to work. Another setting or property that you can change maybe for the password is the property password char. This one over here. You can go to that property and maybe change it to something like a star. Then it will hide your password so the user cannot see the password. So if you are writing a program, let's say for your pet, for example, you can maybe add something like a checkbox there as well. Then the user can select or check on the checkbox and you can choose to hide your password or uncheck it to display your password again.